everyone, my name is Christian from Solitax Solutions and in this week's video I'm going to show you how to add your own cable to the SolidWorks Electrical database. SolidWorks Electrical comes with a lot of predefined cables already. However, there might be a situation where you cannot find the cable that you want and you want to use that inside SolidWorks Electrical. What we can do is we go simply inside SolidWorks Electrical to the library tab and then left click on Cable Reference Manager. This will open up the Cable Reference Manager and in here we can specify our own cable. I will simply go to New Reference and the first thing that you want to do is you want to select the standard for your conductor size. So let's use a millimeter squared in this case and give this a nice part number. Add a manufacturer, specify a class, an article number. This might be the number um, that is in the catalog of the manufacturer. Specify a library. You can even specify a <clears throat> family as well. Now, all this general information is used in the filters um, when we actually look for the cable. So it's good to be as to give it as much as information as possible because then it's very easy to find the cable. My cable type is going to be a power. The outer diameter of the cable is going to be 16 millimeters. We can specify the color. So when we route the cable inside SolidWorks, it will come with the um, color orange and the conductor section is two and a half millimeters squared. So this is for the conductor and the diameter is for the actual outer cable diameter. We give it a description and you can specify multiple user data as well. So maybe your company has an internal reference number for this as well. And we can add user data in one, user data two, um, in here as well. Now, the most important thing is we need to specify some cores as well. So in this case, I'm doing four cores. So I'm hit the button four times. Next, we can specify description as well. So if I click in here, we can give it any description we want. This description will be used when you run a report inside SolidWorks Electrical. And this one is going to be ground. We've got a couple of different types here. I will leave it to miscellaneous for the phases. However, this one will be a protection. Now you can see that the section is automatically filled in because we've put it in here for the conductor section. Um, so the only thing that we want to do is specify a color inside sol for um, SolidWorks itself when we do the actual 3D route. Um, back. Uh, maybe give this bottom one green yellow. Now. As you can see, the top color, this top color will be used by SolidWorks. So once we route this cable, we will now have the three black ones and a green yellow cable. Actually, SolidWorks itself will route this cable as a green cable. I will just simply click on OK. And we will close this. Now, if I have two terminal strips over here and I want to connect them together, Just simply draw a cable. And we can now look for the cable. There is my section standard, millimeters squared. And maybe I can look for a manufacturer. And you can find my cable that I've specified over here. Left click on add to select it. And you can see the cable that we've created with the description and we can now simply wire this up ourselves that's it for this week's video thank you for watching guys